Mrs. Collins, I'm really sorry for your loss. Can you tell me what happened? I was asleep. A loud shot woke me up. I ran downstairs and he was... He was... <laughs> and what about you, Miss Collins? Where were you last night? Well, I... John! John! Oh, God, no! Who are you? Take your hands off my husband. My name is Gloria Vane. I love this man. Get out! Now! No, honey. Let her talk. You are my husband's mistress. Yes, I'm probably the last person to see him alive. I was here last night. You were here? I guess we have our suspects. <laughs> No, I didn't suspect anything. Last night, I was on my way to bed. Honey, I'm going to bed. Are you coming? No, no, I'll stay up for a while. Good night. Thank you, Mrs. Collins. You may go now. Miss Wayne, could you tell me what happened? Well, John called me up at about 11.30 last night. Hello? Tonight? You don't think we'll get caught? <laughs> okay, love, I'll be there. Gun recoil is a result of momentum conservation, which is an extremely important fundamental principle. Newton was talking about momentum conservation when he wrote, every action has an equal and opposite reaction. Momentum characterizes an object's resistance to change in motion. If this is motion along a straight line, we call it linear momentum. Although the bullet's mass is small, its speed is quite large, so it released with large momentum. The gun has much larger mass, so the recoil speed is much smaller, but still large enough to give a serious kick against the shooter's shoulder. If that happened, the killer's arm must be hurt. Well, let's check. <laughs> You heard him talking on the phone and calling Gloria to come over. You waited until she left, grabbed the rifle and shot Mr. Colin. You are under arrest. You have the right to remain silent. 